Let's take a look at the type of reaction for sodium hydroxide, NaOH, plus hydrochloric acid yields sodium chloride plus the water here. So this is two different types of reactions. The first is called a neutralization reaction. When you have a base and an acid, they combine to form a salt plus water. So that's neutralization. You can tell that this is a base. You have a metal bonded to this OH. It's called the hydroxide ion. So if you have the hydroxide ion with your metal, that's a base. Then you have a compound that starts with H, and that often means that it's an acid. So those will come together. They'll neutralize to give salt and water. Either one of these, sodium hydroxide or hydrochloric acid, is dangerous on its own. But when they neutralize into a salt and water, you're left with salt water. The other type of reaction is called a double displacement reaction. For the sodium, that has a positive charge, and this hydroxide ion is negative. Hydrogen, that's in group one, it's positive. And then chlorine, that has a negative charge. So in a double displacement reaction, the positives, they switch places or if you like, the negative switch places. That would look something like this. We put these two together, and each of them, they break apart, and now this sodium will join with the chlorine. And then this negative hydroxide, that joins with the hydrogen. So the negative and the positives, those are together, and we have NaCl, that's our one product, and then HOH, that's just H2O. So that's a double displacement reaction where we have the positives and the negatives switch places. Let's look at that one more time. So for the reaction, sodium hydroxide plus hydrochloric acid yields sodium chloride plus H2O, it's two types of reactions. It's both a double displacement and a neutralization reaction. This is Dr. B with the type of reaction for NaOH plus HCl. Thanks for watching.